Hello YouTubers and welcome to another Disney Pixar Cars Diecast Review. Today we're going to take a look at Cars 3 Floyd Mulvihill, the gas sprint piston cup racer number 70 from the first Cars movie. Now before we get right into the review, let me discuss something. So, <clears throat> as I had mentioned in one of my previous videos, Floyd Mulvihill had surgery between 2006 and 2015 to resemble Cal Weathers. And during his return in Cars 3, he was one of the racers to participate in the, 20, the, the Dynaco Light 350 of the 2016 Piston Cup season at the Motor Speedway of the South. And when Next Gen Racers started dominating the, the Piston Cup circuit, he was replaced by his sponsor, Gasprin, in favor of a next-gen racer named Richie Gunzit. And during his uh, diecast releases, he was first released as part of a fir the first wave of part of a wave of launchers, along with Brian Spark, Speedy Comet, and Lightning McQueen, alias Cars Three Lightning McQueen. And he was released, re-released a couple of times is in, as part of the Des Blue De the Blue Desert series, as a single, as part of the Piston Cup Racer series, and in a Piston Cup Race 11 pack, and hasn't been and hasn't received a re-release ever since. And now, without any further ado, let's dig right into the review. Oh, and I also forgot to mention that I got him off of eBay. So and now, without any further ado, let's dig right into the review. So here we've got his happy, friendly facial expression, his working headlights, yellow number 70 at the bottom, his grill, his blue exterior paintwork, and on the hood we've got the Gasprin logo, which is, which is now in the shape of a, a pill half yellow and half purplish blue and in the background we have half blue and half yellow and on both sides we've got the black rims on the black wall light year racing tires and the light year logo on the front fenders and the exhaust pipes and a blue number 70 and the bit of shade of yellow and a few contingency logos saying Piston Cup, Vitaline, Revolting, RPM, Nitrate, Octane, and Clutch Aid. And the Gasprin logo and the ex gas cap. And on the top we've got a number 70 with the blue background. Purple. And no name signature. And on the trunk we have bit of yellow background with the Gasprin logo and the slogan Hood Ache Relief and the blue spoiler and on the back we have the Gasprin logo in the middle and the orange working head tail lights and the black bumper the black back bumper I, I meant to say and the the slogan Hood Ache Relief in white and the yellow number 70 and on the undercarriage it says made in China and that is it now let's compare him to the, his Cars 1 counterpart also known as Cars 1 Floyd Mulvihill <clears throat> so here we've got so here are some similarities and differences <clears throat> Both are Floyd Mulvihill. Both bear the number 70 for Team Gasper in the Piston Cup. But here are some differences. Cars 1 body mold. Cars 3 body mold. Angry expression. Happy expression. And as you can see, both shades of blue and yellow are different. Darker shades. Lighter shades. 2005 Gasprin logo, 2016 Gasprin logo, 
both have no-name signatures on the top and both have the number 70 on the top. Both have the Gasprin logos on the trunks and the spoilers are blue. Both have the black rims on the black wall light your racing tires and the exhaust pipes on both sides and the gas caps and on the left that is. Both have the Gasprin logo and a number 70. Several contingency logos, less contingency logos, light year in front fenders, no light year in front fenders. And both have the slogan, Hood Ache Relief. Number 70 on tail light, number 70 on back bumper. And that is it. Now let's pull up some of the other Piston Cup racers that share his body mold. We have Cal Weathers, Todd Marcus, Dirk San Diego Stino, Murray Clutchburn, Darren Leadfoot, Punchy Wipeout, and Terry Cargas, even though he's an Excello Fijon EA like Brick Yardley. Oops. And some of the other Team Gasparin racers. We have Cars 1, Floyd Mulvihill, and Richie Gunzit. Although I wish I can review all the Team Gasparin racers, but unfortunately, there is one more Gasprin racer that has not been released yet, which is Richie Gunzit, who was seen in Cars 3 during the projected achieved filmed footage of Doc Hudson's crash on Fireball Beach in 1954. The link to his bio will be in the description down below. So what do you guys think? Which Cal Weathers body mold is your favorite? And which Team Gasprin Racer is your favorite? Is it Cars 1 Floyd Mulvihill? Cars 3 Floyd Mulvihill? Or Richie Gunsit? And which car do you wish for me to review tomorrow? Oh, although I have Billy Oil Changer left. left. Now. And what do you make of Richie Gunzid from, from Cars 3 during the pre-filmed footage of Doc Hudson's crash on Fireball Beach? Let me know what you think as well as leaving suggestions in the comments down below. And if you have enjoyed this video, please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And also don't forget to check out some of my other videos on my channel. And I hope to see you guys next time for another review, so please stay tuned. Goodbye now!